Okay, my camera stopped. Okay, dude got upset and stuff like that. Anyway, so that being said, so the simple fact of the matter was like, I got up in his face, I let him know he was going to do that to me. The first thing I'm thinking is the girl that got beat up and stuff like that in New York City and she was murdered. And I, all these things I stopped in my head at the bus stop and stuff like that. And I was like, okay, we're going to war. Now, if we go to war, I'm not going to war the way you think you're. I'm not going to beat you to try to get you to understand my situation. It's going to be, it's going to be two things going to happen. Either I'm going to jail and you going into the morgue. It's, that's the only way it's going to happen. Because when I fight, I fight for murder. I'm not fighting to fucking get you to understand my point of view. Because if you're going to come at me, you better come correct. And like I tell anybody, you do not fuck with the abuse. If somebody's been abused, do not fuck with them. Because you may gag your repercussions and stuff like that, and that's how it is. And with the girls like me, we already know. We've already been abused. We've already been talked about, shitted on, talked about really bad, brought into places, been murdered, stuff like that. We get, even by the, L, the, the gay community, even coming up sometimes, too. Not all of them. When I do make my videos, I do not mean every single person. Because for some reason, some people get it misconstrued that they always think I'm talking about everybody. And they everything ain't for everybody. There are actually some guys out here that are really nice. They really want me to be a girl like me, but... So many bad guys and got to us, so we not even hearing that shit. Anyway, that being said, my thing is this. I don't knock anybody hustle. Well, anyway, the end of the story is that he left. When he saw me rear all up and he realized that Dr. Banner turns into the hawk motherfucker got his shit together and said, Bitch, you crazy, and walked up to the door and left me. <laughs> but it's okay. This is my third thing of editing. Okay, the purpose of this video was to let you know that <sighs> girls like me or anybody, even though someone is, okay, the, the girls like me, when you bring these guys home and you think that this is going to be the one, a lot of times those could be the ones that try to kill you, and I know it's not exempt of us to just, it goes all around the board, but that being said, and my thing is this is that for the people out here, you know, the guys and stuff like that, when you don't want to be seen with us and you do all this negative thing when it comes down to us and stuff like that, you never know who's going to have to be the one to pick your ass up. And at the end of the day, when every time you need somebody to ride and die for you, when the simple fact of the matter was that you did all that to try to represent your boys, don't come back to us and feel as though we're going to have some type of empathy for you when you said fuck us when it came down to who we are, and yet you want to be the one sharing DNA with us, showing us you don't give a fuck. Anyway, that being said, you know, my thing is this, is that, you know, treat people the way you want to be treated, and everybody goes up, everybody goes down, everybody goes through trials and tribulations, and the simple fact of the matter is that I'm not the one, and I'm not trying to say I'm this tough person and stuff like that, because I'm really not, but my heart went out to that person, and I felt really bad, but I threw them out, and I'm not have nothing to do with them. It's pretty much a wrap, and my thing is this, is that be careful of the crosses that you bear when you're doing your dirt. Because you never know we have to come back to that cross after you done did your dirt. And sometimes people are not as welcome to welcome you back. And that's me because I'm not. Anyway, on top of that, I hate to tell you, but I kind of thought that he might be trying to play me. You know, bitch, I was thinking. And then on top of that, I kind of thought maybe he had a disease. I don't know. I wasn't trying to find out. I wasn't trying to be a statistic. Anyway, that being said. I just wanted to put that out there, simple fact of the matter, that for you guys and stuff like that. You know, this is not a bashing men video, but you know I got more to do. Because that's what I do. I know. I'm just a male bashing bitch. Whatever you want to call me, I don't give a fuck until y'all fix this shit. I'm going to bash the fucking hell out of you. And if you come at me and you want to be with me and stuff like that, you got to bring me something. And it's like, well, I thought you was different. You wasn't like the other girl. Well, guess what? Think again. <laughs> anyway. I just want to hit you all to that, and remember what I said before, I'm not knocking nobody's hustle, you do what you got to do at the end of the day, but if you want to step with me and you a drug dealer, what case may be, don't even bother, because my thing is this, and anything ever goes down, I have to go with you, and a lot of girls are not thinking that way, because you got this big dick and you do all those fabulous things in the bed, but at the end of the day, you may be doing it or nothing, anyway. I want to say hello all new people, boom, I want to say hello old people, bam, and I want to thank you for watching, thank you for subscribing, I want you to do you, I want you to do you the best way you can, nobody like it, then fuck them.